to go with the roof closed here at Rogers Center and Francisco Lindor the multi talented shortstop for the Indians steps in. And the first pitch of Ryan Barucki see Lindor an all star each of the last four years. Combines power speed a lot of personality one of the great young players in the game as he grounds one to the left of Freddie Galvis sliding back to his feet and on to first. Guys missed almost four months with an elbow issue just back to the big leagues and now has some blood on his finger up and now we're starting to see blood on the uniform. Fastball sharply hit into center field and this will produce two runs for the Indians as Lindor drives in a couple to give Cleveland the early lead. This inning is over and Ryan Brucky is sitting down on that bench but he has to face Lindor with a couple of runners in scoring position two seamer trying to get that thing away and Lindor right back through the middle such a clutch player such a good player against the Blue Jays and be careful with him at first base he you know he's coming off the bag will play behind the runner Lindor who will be on the move Lindor might smile more than any player in the major <laughs> leagues he, there's nothing wrong with that he has a good time out on the field. How do you not have fun playing baseball? This guy loves to play the game and he's good. Indians fans already dreading the day where they assume he's wearing another uniform. There's a good slider. That's a fair ball. Squibs it just inside the line. Into foul territory down the right field line. Guerrero digging for second and is tagged out. Teams have been throwing a lot of 0 1 sliders to Vladimir's the ball, spins all the way around in a one hop to make the play. Look at this throw. One hop right there. You see how low that ball Lindor picked that thing clean and everybody arrived at the same time at second base and he held on to the ball. Of all the baseball. That I watch. That Lindor's not the biggest guy in the world, but the last two years has hit 33 and 38 home runs. And if you're talking about guys who combine power, speed, defense, how many guys are on his level? Mike Trout is a guy on his level, but. He's got great hands. And by that I mean it's hand eye coordination but his hands get that bat out into a hitting position fast. He's got fast hands. He's already set the franchise record for home runs for a shortstop. Already. Sets up and watch how lightning quick those hands come through the strike zone. Back at the beginning of the season. Paul Dolan the owner of the Indians said quote we control him for three more years enjoy him and then we'll see what happens and that obviously as there's ball four that obviously made some Indians fans very concerned saying what do you mean just for three more years but they're a small market team and this is going to be a guy who's going to make an enormous amount of money because plain and simple he's one of the best players in the game. Mike Trout is the best player in the game but that's some pretty good company that Lindor is keeping. Yeah if you go by war wins above replacement he's the fourth best since 2016. There are some superstars and some MVPs on that list right there. Trout Betts and Yelich Francisco Lindor at 21 and a half wins above replacement fourth best in all of 2016. So yeah he'd be tough to replace but they've had to. I've looked at that and I don't see where they can go. Richard grounds into a double play. Top of the order Francisco Lindor fortunately from what we know is OK. As Lindor gets a bunt down Guerrero nice play. That'll go down as a sacrifice runner to third one out Lindor we have seen this on a number of occasions this year and Lindor came out after the game and said he believes all teams should extend netting all the way down to the foul pole we saw that terrible accident in Houston earlier this year when a young child season grounded to short backhanded play and Lindor purposely skips it across on the turf to get the out two down. Is that easy? 
<laughs> he makes it look easy over at shortstop. He knew he had to hustle instead of setting his feet and throwing. He's going to throw on the run. He's going to bounce it over. A perfect bounce pass in basketball, yeah. huh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no tricky hop, no in between hop. And it bounces about eye high, which is perfect for the first baseman. On how he should try to attack Lindor. Slider fouled off. Off an inning and get another one. Tell you what, it'll make the. Down the right field line, but this will be foul. Out. Runner goes. Not going this time, and a swing and a miss to get him against Clevenger. Ground ball to the left side. There's one and two. Now a message. But if Schaefer has to go on the injured list, then I don't know if one of those guys would be the logical. What does the major league team need? Where's notice and get guys on planes, trains, and automobiles and get them from one place to another? Lindor grounds out. One, two, three.